There's a new case of the measles in Clark County today, and this one involves a child under the age of 10 who we know was not vaccinated. There are no new exposure sites, though, connected to the case. Since the start of the year, 64 people in Clark County have gotten the measles. For a list of all of the exposure sites since this outbreak started, be sure to visit coin.com. We're digging deeper on this tonight, and health officials in Clark County say Nearly all the recent measles patients in the county weren't vaccinated. One local doctor who grew up in Ukraine says many of her own patients continue to begin having their kids vaccinated because they're scared. Let's go to our Wayne Haverly, who met with that doctor, who says much of the fear is originating on social media sites in Eastern Europe. Wayne? Yeah, that video that we're talking about in question, it appears to be a newscaster claiming that several children were paralyzed one day after being vaccinated for measles. However, it is just not true, according to Dr. Tatyana Oderich, who treats mostly Eastern European patients in her Happy Valley office. She discovered the post, which already has 5 million views, on a social media site that's similar to Facebook. It's called Classmates. But there is no contact information. She says many of her Eastern European patients are afraid of vaccinating their kids because of bad information on the Internet that they're seeing. She offers CDC information about vaccinations that are translated into Russian and Ukrainian, hoping to educate her wary patients, but it's not an easy process. So I'm asking them, do you want to talk about vaccinations? And almost universally, the answer was, nope, I did my research, I don't want to talk about it. Well, the recent outbreak in Clark County has more and more of her patients changing their minds about vaccinations. She has seen a substantial increase, she says, in parents agreeing to immunize their kids for measles, mumps, and rubella, which is all in one shot. Dr. Otterich attended medical school in Ukraine and at OHSU, and she says the current measles outbreak in Ukraine, it's infected over 50,000 people so far. There have been deaths there. Health officials also say the measles strain that we're seeing in Vancouver it originated in the Ukraine. The doctor grew up in the Soviet Union and says that there was a, a time when vaccines in Eastern Europe, they were not kept at proper temperatures, which made them ineffective and in some cases made people sick. So perhaps some of that is behind some of this misinformation out there now. Yeah, yeah it's a constant battle against misinformation. Yes.